the festive spirit on Fisherman's Island carried into the new year. The celebration started at 8 p.m. on New Year's Eve with entertainment provided by the different clans on the island. This continued into a New Year church service hosted by the United Church. The church service ended with the congregation committing to live behind bad habits. As dawn broke on New Year's Day, the clan in charge of organizing celebrations carried out the traditional New Year's washing. They splashed some with water. and threw others into the sea. <laughs> As dictated by custom, those being washed will bear a gift for the organizers. It can come in the form of new clothing items which they will wear at the time of the washing. Kwamanuma clan who hosted this year's celebrations were very happy with how the day turned out. Put our heads together and we contributed and and it has come up to today, and it's really amazing, you know. Uh, awesome that this year we have uh, done things that we, we also believe ourselves that we were not expecting to do. So. The day was full of activities that included sea races and other sports. But the main event was the sharing of food and gifts. The organizing clan gave each of the other four clans tents full of household items and uncooked food to share amongst themselves. Visitors on that day were impressed with the celebrations. Well, uh, Fisherman Island is uh, different from Hanobara. Like, it's a different atmosphere here. Like, the, the people are very friendly, and uh, especially, like, kids are enjoying it here. Uh, that's why I, I came, uh, I brought my family here to enjoy uh, the islanders and their visitors closed the first day of 2015 with a huge feast. Sarah Aupong, National MTV News.